Copy. What is it, Troy? Savvy has an idea how to break through the radio jamming and contact the outside world. He'll be working on that while you're busy looking for Jay. I'll be in touch. And if I may make a suggestion, avoid the infected if you can, okay? They've always been dangerous, but now they're mutating into something even more deadly. Hey, buddy. Have you seen a woman named Jade Aldemir? She's got long, dark hair. She's tough as nails. Yeah, she was talking to what's his name over there. Thanks. Jade? Jade, are you here? Who are you? What do you want? No sign of Jade. Damn it. Hey, 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 can you help me? I'm looking for a young woman, dark hair, petite, takes no shit from anyone. Her name's Jade Aldemir? Yes. She was here. You didn't miss her by too much. She waited around for a while with a big scowl on her face, and then took off. God damn it, did she, did she say where she was going? No. But your crane, right? She left this for you. That's a mirror. Why would she have left me this? Well, I can't say for certain. But she did ask me to tell you, not again. Don't know what that's supposed to mean. Fidan wanted to tell you something. You should talk with him. His friend, Rupert, is a real magician when it comes to fighter arms. All right, thanks for the tip. Jade, this is Crane. Do you copy? Jade, can you hear me? Troy, this is Crane. Do you copy? Crane, I was just about to contact you. Savvy broke through the jamming and... I think you better get back here. You have to see this. Why? What do I what do I have to see? You have to see it for yourself. Just get back here, all right? I'm serious. No matter how many times I watch it, I still can't believe it. An internal global relief effort document surfaced today that, if verified, implicates the GRE in a far-reaching criminal conspiracy. Instead of trying to find a cure for the Haran virus, according to the file, the GRE had plans to weaponize it and sell it to the highest bidder. Worldwide backlash has... No, no, skip to the important bit. I was the last survivor left in the quarantine. I can't believe I made it out. I can't believe I'm still alive. We mourn all those who didn't survive. But as the president said in a speech here earlier today, life is for the living. Military troops have searched for survivors all over the quarantine, but now there's no one left besides the infected. According to Colonel Tanner, once his decontamination process is finished, the infection will be completely obliterated. Ministry did this. They're making their excuses to the rest of the world for destroying a city. Look, Crane, before you go charging out of here, we already had an idea of how to send a message. We were going to plant explosives in a building and set off fires in a pattern, something the zombies could never do. Trouble is, we got a runner, Michael, over to the right building, but he can't get through to the top floors. Too many biters. As much as I hate to admit it, none of the rest of us are strong enough to do this job. Well, we've got to do something right fucking now, or you, me, Jade, and everybody else are going to get blown to bits. I tell Michael I'm on my way, and while I'm doing that, can you get in touch with Jade? Try to get her to meet me. You have my word. Craig, uh, one more thing. Rise brought some of his shock squads to Old Town. I've only been here for a few weeks, but they're doing a lot of damage. They're launching raids and terrorizing survivors at every opportunity. It seems Rise officially ordered them to be as brutal as possible. Yeah, he likes people to know he's in town. They're well fortified. In addition to their headquarters, they're using two staging grounds to gather supplies. I'm told they've amassed quite a haul. 
Could use some supplies. Ha! Huh. You'd be doing us all a very big favor. Where are the outposts? One's in an office building, and the other is in the radio station. Uh, maybe I'll pay him a visit.